all of us, or many of us in the room would remember that chess match very vividly. And yet, that didn't carry on the way Watson right. clearly has taken hold and carry on. What's the difference now? Yeah, actually, a, a, you know, other than it was a, a game, in a sense, two entirely different research objectives. Uh, at the time, I, I was also uh, leading the group in 96, 97, when we built Deep Blue. And uh, that was, we wanted to see how, and it, it seems trivial now, but how big and how fast a system we could build for deep searches, uh, you know, in games, sequential moves. And uh, we, again, looked around for something that was a good test of that. And, you know, in the back of our minds, we're also always thinking, well, if we want to use these systems to assist humans, then why not test them against humans? And so we came up with the chess, chess match. But that was to test, you know, a certain set of algorithms. As we embarked on Watson and, you know, we saw the opportunity around it, we realized that this is much more than just exploring a big data search engine. This, this is a completely different deal. And that what we were really... Uh, inventing was, in a sense, the system 360 of the next era of computing. Mm. Uh, just as the 360 was the first, really the first commercial programmable system, you know, on a broad-based enterprise-ready, Watson is sort of that for the next era mm. of computing. Mm.